I live just outside of Brighton, which is famous for many things. One of those is the pier. So this morning I got up at 5 a.m. and it was freezing to do some footage for you. Hope it was worth it. <laughs> Palace Pier, or Brighton Pier, started life in 1891 as a replacement for the Royal Suspension Chain Pier that collapsed. It was the third pier to be constructed in Brighton, the others being the original Chain Pier and the West Pier, and cost a record amount of £27,000. The Palace Pier opened in 1899 and quickly became popular as an entertainment venue. The theatre hosted the likes of Stan Laurel, Charlie Chaplin, Tommy Trinder and Dick Emery. The pier is 1,722 feet or 525 metres long and contains a staggering 85 miles of planking. Because of its length, it takes a team of guys three months every year to repaint it. At night, it's illuminated by 67,000 bulbs. During World War II, the pier was closed as a security precaution. A section of its decking was removed in order to prevent access from enemy ships landing. Brighton Pier has featured in many movies over the years, including Brighton Rock, Mona Lisa, Sweeney Todd, and Carrion at Your Convenience. In March 1964, after spending a freezing cold night underneath the pier, a young Pete Townsend from The Who was inspired by it enough to write the album Quadrophenia, which was later on turned into a film in 1974. During his storm in 1973, a 70-foot ton barge moored at the pier's landing stage broke loose and began to damage the pier, particularly the theatre. The landing pier had to be demolished and the damaged theatre was never used again. The theatre was replaced two years later with a domed amusement arcade and consequently the seaward end of the pier was filled with fairground rides. Entertainment continued to be popular at the bar at the end of the pier and in 1996 it hosted a performance from the Spice Girls. Renamed Brighton Pier in 2000, locals still refer to it as the Palace Pier and it remains a popular tourist attraction to this day with over 4 million visitors per year. So if you enjoyed that video please press the subscribe button below and I will see you on the next one.